The world's first clinical trial was done at sea aboard the Royal Navy's HMS Salisbury in 1747. Between 1500 and 1800, during the Age of Exploration, it's estimated that some 2 million people were killed by scurvy. So there was this physician on board named James Lind. He was far from the first person to suggest citrus as a cure for scurvy, but there was still no widespread use. Two months after scurvy started affecting the crew, he took 12 scorbutic sailors, a fancy word for scurvy having, and divided them into six groups of two. They all were given the same diet each day, but each group was given a different proposed cure for their scorbutic affliction. On top of their rations, group one got a quart of cider. Another got 25 drops of elixir of vitriol, which is sulfuric acid. The third got six spoonfuls of vinegar. Sailors in group four must have drawn the super short straws because they got to drink a half a pint of seawater. The fifth got two oranges and a lemon. And the sixth got a spicy paste and barley water. After just six days, they ran out of fruit, but the two lucky sailors in group five improved significantly more than all the others. One of them was declared fit for duty, and the other became better than the rest and was appointed nurse to the other afflicted. The only other group that saw any improvement at all was the vinegar group. Despite his findings, he tiptoed around the conclusion. He wrote that citrus had a peculiar advantage, but continued to share his medical opinion that it had a lot of different causes. He thought that the hard work, bad water, and confinement at sea contributed to the bloody gums and death. And he thought that eating salted meat in damp areas made it so that you couldn't sweat or shit properly. He also tried to make a concentrated lemon juice extract by boiling the lemons, but boiling lemons breaks down the vitamin C, so that was just a distraction. His half-hearted conclusions went against the grain of what the Royal Society and other physicians thought, so it would be 42 more years till citrus was made a compulsory part of the Royal Navy's diet. Also, it's not related, but I want to show you my lemon tattoo.